Hi Mean and welcome to another episode of Cooking Cute Meals. Today we're making a prawn squash curry. Let's go. What we have here is a number of things. We have roasted and then peeled squash. Butternut squash, sorry. Red kidney beans, kale, some prawns marinated in apple cider vinegar, onions, mushrooms, baby plum tomatoes, garlic as always. The new addition, garam masala, pineapples, and some parmesan, as well as these two beauties, as always. Let's go. Up our base ingredients. Wok is um, oiled up. <laughs> the wok. <laughs> the wok in it. <laughs> so we've got our base ingredients. We've got the oil in the wok. Now the wok cooks everything very quickly. So this meal is going to be extra quick. Go in straight for the kill. Get the turmeric. Cayenne. Garam masala. Now garam masala has a mixture of coriander, cumin, pimento, nutmeg, pepper, carrot, car cardamom. I don't even know what it is. Anyway, clove, fennel, and bay leaves. So it's a nice mixture of different herbs and spices. Usually used in curries, which is what we're doing today. A little bit of sea salt. And Next, got your prawns. Covered with the turmeric, it come nice and brown or yellow. Once you've got the turmeric, next. Our butternut squash. I roasted this previously for 20 minutes and then I peeled it. Or you can either boil it or roast it, same difference. Butternut squash is very good in a curry, it tastes very nice. Then, my favourite old red kidney beans. Chuck it in. Again, mix. Now, kale. If you haven't got kale, use spinach. If you haven't got spinach, use greens, whatever. Now what we're going to do is put a lid on top so the kale can steam up for a bit. We give it around two minutes. Turn down the heat a little because the wok is already very high. So we've got two minutes for that to simmer a bit. Let's go.
steam through. So we're just gonna mix it on. Very, very quick. Very, very simple. Now, if you don't have these exact ingredients in your house, you can use sweet potato, use normal potato, yam, anything. Just make sure you've got a curry powder or turmeric just to give it that curry feel. And then a green addition to it. Boom. A lovely addition, you don't have to, but Parmesan just tastes boom on top of it. So, I'm just gonna sprinkle some on top. And that is literally it. Loads of household essentials, one meal. Quack, quick and keep meals, prawn squash, curry. Like, comment and subscribe to my page and let's keep working.